Hey everyone, it's Ron from Fists of Rage Gaming, and um, since our last video, what I did is I came just outside the Wayward, dropped our shelter, went inside, scrapped everything, stored any excess ammunition, um, checked our weapons, checked our armor, make sure everything was tip top shape, and we will actually, you know, one thing I do want to do before we get started here is I do want to go in and, and get some more ammunition, I think. I think we got 635 rounds. Maybe I'll make a little bit more just to be greedy. I think we'll be using this 10 millimeter for a little while, so. Um, and I can't make that much. I think, yeah, I'm low on gunpowder. But just I got plenty of lead, plenty of steel. Now, if I want to make gunpowder, I can go over here to the chemistry station. And what you'll see in order to get more gunpowder is. You'll need acid and you'll need cloth. So that's why we focus on acid a lot. Because it does help us make gunpowder. So we can make 26 gunpowder. And we'll come over here again. And you'll see now we have gunpowder. So now we can make more. You'll see it actually shows 392 gunpowder. So it's quite a bit. So now we can make plenty of ammo. I don't think we'll go that far because I don't know how long we'll be using the 10 millimeter. So let's make a batch of 40. So it's... Of course, I just made 45 rounds. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, luckily I saved some, right? So we'll just have to make sure we use 45 ammunition later, which we do because that's what the... that's what the fixer uses, and I think that's why it was on my brain. Sorry about that. But that's fine because we will definitely use it later on. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to continue on with our mainline quests, new arrivals. So we'll just continue on with that one once we get back in Appalachia here. And the first step, I believe, is listen to the Overseer's broadcast. So let's do that. Uh oh, we can help him get rid of this protector. Try him first. Since we got at least one hit on it, we are able to take stuff off of it, get a little bit of scrap. So let's get out of the way in case that thing explodes. I don't think it's going to. Usually hear it winding up by then, but you never know. We'll listen to the overseer's broadcast. Are you? Broadcasting to the people of Vault 76. This is the overseer. We need to talk face to face. I've missed all of you, but this isn't just about a reunion. We have work to do. I'll be waiting in Sutton. Right. So we need to go see the Overseer. Before we do that, what I think I'm going to do is... Go somewhere safe here. You know what? Actually, we can... We can go to the train station in Sutton real quick. Or, well, I mean, doesn't matter which way to go. Let's just go to Sutton in general. I think if we go to Sutton in general, though, we might have to do a little bit of shooting, but that's all right. A little shooting never hurt us, right? We could go to the train station. Remember in one of our previous videos, at least two videos ago, we stopped by that train station. We looked back, and you could see the overseer's house, so kind of pointed out where it was at. And, I mean, we're going to basically... Oh, we can grab these garden notes. Kind of like the way they laugh when you pick them up. Kind of creepy. So, I mean, we could have... We could have fast-traveled to that train station right there. The overseer's house is right there, so... We could have done either one. I think there are some scorched around here. If I remember correctly. Huh. There's dead scorched up there. On top of that building. Another dead scorched? I think they're dead. Sidetrack. Not 
all dead because I can. Oh, a bunch of them are dead. I hear one of them yapping. Creepy voice. I can see his foot. Ooh, that had to hurt. Right on the toe bone. Yep. Now he's running amok. <laughs> Where'd he go? There he is. That's gotta be annoying getting a shot on the top of your head. Did I get him? I didn't get him. Wait, now there's bullets flying from everywhere. Stirred up a hornet's nest. Why don't you shoot me from way over there? Here, I'll let you take a little bit of that. That was some mighty fine 10 millimeter aim in there. I was gonna say I can hear some really close. Look at that. I get some 10 millimeter ammo. 10 millimeter ammo on it. Okay, where's this other guy coming from? Bullets are flying from somewhere. Oh, there you are. Nice. There seems to be a lot of them around here. You want a little bit of this, buddy? I hope I can shoot you through the stairs. I know you can shoot me through the stairs. That's not chinky. Where'd you go? Okay. I'm not going to wait all day for you. Where'd he go? Nope, Raider's not looking too good. Where'd he go? There's a bunch of Raiders around here all dead and stuff. I just say dead and stuff like dead and there's some other stuff that could be going on. I think you're kind of dead. You hear some pitter patter and some feet. Love recipe. Dog meat steak. Mmm. Oh, there you are. Oh, that had to hurt. I love a little decapitation. Here's some seriously close thumping. Oh, that scared the bejeebus out of me. You leave me alone. Yeah, I was aimed right at him and hit the wall like five times. Just about enough, you guys. Just trying to pick up some clothes. Didn't want any trouble. Mannequin. I'm upstairs. I get very distracted. Don't I? I apologize for it, but it's kind of fun. Repent. That didn't go so well for you. I'll take those ten pictures, though. It's kind of ironic that I'm going to church to grab the ten pictures so I can get lead so I can make bullets. It just does not seem right. journal. You can pause if you want to read that. I'll turn the page. You can pause if you want to read that. We will take it. All right. Yeah, got a pistol. Don't know why I had a pistol sitting there in the middle of church. All right, so we're kind of back, back where we started. That was kind of a round robin. Keep going here. Overseer has some nice convenient steps set up for us. I know the overseer's garage has a bunch of a bunch of uh, benches in it, so we can get rid of all this stuff. And I always take everything from the overseer's house, too, just because I'm a scrapping cretin. Don't 
Don't know why she has such a nice house. We're all up here suffering. It just proves that she's the man. You know what I'm saying? Don't worry, we'll clean up for you over here. There's all this big mess out here. Good. So we could go through that door, but her garage is open, so we could just go in here, scrap everything. Whoa. Okay. I'm not gonna lie that that just didn't creep me out. Wow. Can't take the fusion core. I feel I feel robbed once again. Not sure what I'm observant rad state is, but it's alright. Taking everything. Alright, so oh, there's some ammo right through. Get it? Alright, so now we can scrap everything. How about weapons? Do we want to scrap weapons? Yeah, that's the one. So we do have some level 10 hunting rifles. Oh, we had something else sturdy. What was that? Nope. Oh. Didn't need to do that. And another piece of armor? Sturdy left leg. Okay, that's better than our regular left leg. We will need to repair it though. So we go, we press Y for modifier repair. We go to the left leg that we have on. You'll see the condition is very low. So we hit Y. If we look down to the lower left, inspect and repair. Hit the X for workbench repair, and you'll see it uses three adhesives. So another reason we get a lot of adhesive. All right, and we can go back and we can scrap that that left leg that we just took off. Excellent. I don't think there's anything particular we want to store. Uh, let's double check. No, nothing there, nothing there. Uh, we could put these things in there. They sell for a pretty good, like golf clothing actually sells for a very good price. So, uh, interestingly enough. Let's go see the overseer. Oh, thank God you're here. I almost... It's just so good to see you. Let's talk downstairs. Cozy as this place is, there's... someone I'd like you to meet. We really went overboard with this place. Feel free to look around. Ooh. This is what we call looking around where I come from. I'll follow you in just a second, Overseer. Don't you worry. Once I take everything that isn't nailed down. Look at her trying to hide that face up there. Come on. Okay. Effort reward thing going on there. Had to give up. Is that pie? Mmm, pumpkin pie. Thank you, Overseer. I'm sure, if I would have asked, you would have given it to me anyways. She needs to wash some dishes. What the heck? I gained a disease. I accidentally drank the water. I guess I drink it again. <laughs> Maybe I got two diseases now. Not particularly worried about the disease. If you want to check, what you can do is you can go to your pit boy. That looks nice and clean now. It was a big mess. You can go to your pit boy. Go to the first page, and you'll see we have 
parasites. Periodic food loss. And looks like all we've got. So yeah, 14 minutes we can have parasites. Follow down in the basement. Take more stuff. Until we're going over rib floor because we're bouncing up and down. Let me introduce you to Davenport. He's been helping me with some reconnaissance. Keeping an eye on Appalachia. Oh, it's so good to meet you. The overseer has been so excited to see everyone again. Once you've acquainted yourself with our new arrivals, I may have some field work for you. I couldn't have pulled this place off without him. Let's talk. I ain't busy stealing everything. I mean, appropriating things that you'd want me to have. Okay. I know you have questions, and we'll get to them. I have an important mission. But of course you do. You're just not ready. It's too dangerous. I can't in good conscience send you on it. Before you do anything, you need to get inoculated against the Scorch disease. You've seen what it does to people. Dr. Hudson was working on a cure. Her research lab was in the Morgantown airport. That should get you started. Is there anything else you want to talk about? Hmm. Um, sure, let's just let's ask her a couple things. Well, remember, it's not a scavenger hunt. I put them in place to help you on your way, even when I can't be there personally. Why wouldn't you just tell me right now? Hmm. Pretty hypocritical for me, of all people, to take off on my own, huh? Oh. <laughs> At first, I was just racing ahead, hoping that if there was any trouble, I'd hit it first. And then there were the nukes, the scorched plague. Seeing my old neighborhood bombed to pieces, I, I needed time. Oh, yeah. All right. That could me be too. me, but... That was very long. I grew up here. My parents used to live just down the hill. If there's one neighborhood I'm rebuilding first, it's this one. Well, you're looking too good now. I'm just saying. I'm working on understanding Dr. Hudson's research better. A and I hope someday soon a simple inoculation can be developed. But I'm not there yet. Her lab, however, can synthesize a specific vaccine for you, if it hasn't broken down again. All right, I guess I can go. I thought we were to ask right. for that one. Go ahead. No. All right. So it looks like that is it for the new arrivals. We have to wait until we're, we're level 20 to go any further, so... You know, it's only a little bit like 18 minute video, 19 minute video, 20 minutes by the time we're done. So um, I think that's good enough for the time being. And what we'll do is we'll pick up um, where we left off. What I'll do is I'll probably go upstairs, um, check out the upstairs of the house, just finish taking everything that I could get my hands on, go out in the garage, scrap, do um, some of the admin things that I do in between videos, and we will pick up probably with an ounce of prevention when we cut back. Uh, but obviously, new arrivals will have to be wait. And we'll have to wait. Um, we have to get to level twenty. We're only level twelve right now, but I think we're doing pretty good. So, I think until next time, I'm Ron, and this is Fists of Rage Gaming.